Alison Marsden here from Gardening by Design. This month's well-being snippet encourages you to get out into the garden and appreciate all the colours of summer. It is well known that the biophilic effect of the colour green is very calming. Green, of course, is the backdrop to all our gardens. But I'm talking here about colours, stopping and staring closely and appreciating the different colours in the garden in summer, not looking at the flowers, but the colours and colour combinations. On a purely practical note, you may get inspiration or ideas for your own garden if you're doing this when visiting. But spend a little bit of time looking at what you like. Why Understand why you like those colours. Is it an innate reaction? Yellow and is associated with happiness. Hot colours are generally considered to be active, and we talk about vibrant and exciting. Fast food restaurants sometimes have orange and yellow chairs, which are thought to make us eat faster and move on more quickly. And cool colours, so typically used, the whites and the blues and the pale colours in well-being gardens, again, for their calming influence. So it may be that your likes and, and dislikes are something innate in all human beings, but it may be an association or a reminiscence, and that might be a happy one, or it might not, but that's something to think about and learn. It may be that you like the simplicity of a single colour, or perhaps the contrast and the simple joy of a rainbow mix. There is no right answer. In fact, the answer doesn't really matter. You might learn something about your relationship with your garden, but at the very least, you will have stopped and focused your mind on the beauty of flowers, got rid for those minutes of some of the chatter that we have running through our heads the whole time. So, spend a few minutes appreciating and thinking about the colours of summer. Happy colourful gardening. Check out my website gardeningbydesign.co.uk for more about me, gardening and therapeutic horticulture.